Nation. Kicking off the Carnival of Care tomorrow in Novi, it's a health care expo for those with disabilities and life-changing injuries. And here to tell us more is Lexis Youssef. Good morning to you. Good morning, Andy. Thank you for having me. Absolutely. Let's talk about this Carnival of Care. Who's it for? What's going on? Sure. Carnival of Care is now in its ninth year, and we're so excited. It's going to be tomorrow, Suburban Collection Showplace in Novi. It's a completely free event to the public, and we're all there to honor and um, celebrate those living with any type of disability. So we encourage everyone to come, popcorn, cotton candy, blow up games, massages, the whole nine yards. So we're really excited. A true carnival yes. out there. So, you know, what types of vendors are we talking about? Um, a lot of, it's kind of like a healthcare expo. You have like medical transportation companies, home care, healthcare agencies, and they have all, they all have like a little booth set up. So people come in, they go to their booth and they actually collect information and get to learn more about the different things that, um, opportunities in their community. And so much of uh, the uh, lives that are affected by disabilities, I yeah. mean, as far as networking goes, that that's huge. It's a huge networking opportunity and we've had a lot of people just snag onto those opportunities really really quickly yeah. so it, the vendors are loving it. Yeah and tell us about your organization the D-Man Foundation. Yes the D-Man Foundation our mission is basically to increase the quality of life however that we can and we do have a music therapy studio that we've talked about in Berkeley and we also do assisted travel so Danny who is um, the whole guy He's behind he, Danny's Miracle Angel Network. Um, he was hit by a car at the age of seven, but despite his disability, he lived the next 16 years of his life, had an amazing life. His family took him on vacations, basketball games, and so we really just want to be able to increase the quality of life for other individuals yeah. as he did. And Danny is uh, your brother, was your brother-in-law? Yes, yeah. Danny was my brother-in-law's brother, so I actually was fortunate enough to meet him, which I'm so happy because yeah. I actually got to meet him for a year before he passed away. You know, Tell me what the folks here, uh, you know, at this carnival, what do they feel? What do they tell you, you know after what? they go through this? I, these people go to therapies and surgeries and all all week they're just in doctor's appointments. And it's really just this one day once a year for them to come out completely free food and get to enjoy themselves and relax. And so many people calling, I can't wait for next year's crying. Thank you for putting it on. It's just so heartwarming. And you have events pretty much all year long. You mentioned the yes. music therapy studio. Yes. Um, you the guys, Dream Cruise Dream Cruise events. Yes. How can people help if they want to be a part of uh, the Well, of course they could donate. Go on to our website, mydemand.org, and make a donation, as well as volunteering. You know, this Carnival of Care event, we really couldn't put it on without the help of our volunteers. We have about 100 people just coming and volunteering, and we're so grateful for them. Yeah, and I think the biggest message is, you know, you are not alone. If you oh, are living course. with a disability, you are not alone, and certainly, uh, the D-Man Foundation is a part of that. Yes, we are. Yeah. Thank you, Andy. Lexus, thank you very much for thank joining us this morning. Me. Let's send it back over to Anu. All right, guys. Thanks so much.